Hello everybody, I'm Rick, and it's my goal to lose weight using Ring Fit Adventure. Hello everybody, welcome to the D-Pad. I'm Rick, this is Ring Fit Adventure. Keep it like this, keep it going at this pace. Gets a little annoying. Even that question's get a little annoying. Can I, can you ask if asking me if it's annoying is getting annoying? Because it is. Uh, but yeah, it is Tuesday here in week 29. We are well into world 20, the city of open eyes. We're gonna see if we can get a little closer to the end of this world today. I suspect that this one, that this world is gonna take us basically through the week. Uh, it's not impossible that we could, let's uh, say like we could potentially go up against, I assume Guru Amma, but it could be Drago, I suppose, uh, on Thursday. I kind of expect it's going to happen on Friday though. I don't know. And if that's the case, there may be a couple requests that we have to take care of on Monday. That's all right. We'll play it by ear. Let's see how things go. But yeah, we are getting through it. We have our new target for uh, skills. It's going to take eight levels just to see what it even is. And then we have to actually pay for the skill. It's going to be another probably four, maybe five levels. So we're going to be at this one for a little while. Probably through the rest of this world and then some. So I do hope that we do have two balanced themed levels and not just one because then we'll be diving in for balance a little bit late although I suppose like my plan once I was comfortable with my balance set was that I was just going to start you know moving in the direction of getting those question marks unlocked so we could see what they were and then getting any stat boosters that we could because skills we're not going to use, there's no purpose in getting them if they're not leading us to something that we want. That we want. So, alright. So we have this level over here that we could skip, but I think we're just going to go for it. Glow Skin Ridge. Doesn't look very long. Should be interesting. Let's go for it. Alright. Oh, it's interesting to see the, uh, the exit from the very start of the level. Doesn't happen all that often. Okay. I'm curious what we will encounter here with it, thinking that we're only going to get four minutes of workout time. It's kind of unusual. There's a monster down there. I don't know why I didn't suck that up. That was kind of unfortunate. Dark Stepper. All right. Let's do this. The trapezoids. All my trapeziums, trapezials, my trapezius muscles are enjoying that we're not, you know, focusing hard on them today. So a little bit of this wouldn't be terrible. But I guess this works on the spinal erectors and the triceps. Oh, I didn't even realize that they're color coded. The triceps being arms and the spinal erectors being core or abs. It didn't even occur to me that it would color code those. That makes sense. Right. More. And now I can screw up a bit. So it is going to take another move to get this guy taken care of. Two more. Alright. Add guard. Cool. Uh, yeah, you know what? This is fine. Just thinking like numbers, just like, alright, is that going to be enough? It should be, though. It's like 80% the strength of the thing we just used. Actually, no, that's not true. It's more like 60 70. 
That's okay, though. We will definitely be taking this guy out. There we go. All right. Not bad at all. Ooh, uh, already a little toasty in here. This is going to be good. So four levels will get us our next step in the direction of the Skilver. We're trying to unlock, or I guess reveal. going on here? We chasing you? No, okay. And we got a five monster battle coming up. Some cash, all right. Never say no to that. You did it. All right, what do we got? Yellow squad with one. Red boy. Um, let's boost our yellow. I think that's probably a good idea. Uh, that one's got healing. That one does the change, so let's do this one. I don't care about the healing, but the ones that actually change your attack color are more valuable to me. I don't know about others, but. I think tactically it's nice to be able to, you know, force, you know, a certain color there. When you're up against enemies that are color coded. Okay, that's one. This guy's not going down, is he? So close. So close. Aw, oh, really, dude? All right, screw it. I don't have to care about this guy. He's going to take nothing to, to take out. Over at arm spin. Here we go. Then there was one. And you know, if you polished up that skinny yours, you'd be a gold hoplin. Be a lot more valuable to me. Just enough for another level, which gets us our first skill point out of four. So we have three more to go before we can get. I think it's a. I think it's an actual balance move that's next, but it's not one that we really care about. And maybe. Really? Okay. I don't know, man. And hey, they were right on with that four with that four minute estimate there. Not bad. I like how the road keeps going there, too. It's kind of a nice touch. All right. All right. And about a thousand. So we have 8K more to go for our next level. Oh, battle gym time. Actually, before we go in, let's make some more smoothies. Uh, let's see. So first of all, we can make another persimmon smoothie. That's always nice. Uh, double ingredient drops. And as I said, yeah, I think we can make some of those. Let's start making some of this. Um, Start with these. Let's squeeze. We are absolutely going to want to double our experience in here, without a doubt. Squeeze. 
because battle gems are great. You're going to get a decent amount of experience from the monsters, but you're going to get a humongous amount of experience from the actual exercise you do. Even more so during a battle gem request, where you're nearly universally going to have to do like, oh, do it one at a time, or oh, do this specific move. Any kind of caveat that means that you have to do more moves, more sets and reps, means you're going to get more experience normally, which means that doubling it is even better better. Alright, the plus side of health. Alright, um... I guess we'll throw... Oh, can I do more than one? Oh, wow, I can do a lot more than one. Alright, let's do five. Uh, between these, I think we'll be fine there. Let's look at yellow. So, attack power... Don't have any vanilla ice cream. Uh, we don't have enough coffee beans for that. That's okay. So let's do some of these and some of the ones that. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we only got the one, huh? All right. It would actually be better do the one that will also recharge skills, just because we can make so many more of them here. I'm not trying to make this whole episode be a smoothie-sode, but sometimes things kind of move in that direction. Alright. What are the, these, these glasses look like the ones that we had in college in, like, the cafeteria. Like, I don't know if I've actually known anyone in the adult world who has that exact kind of glass. Not shaming anybody who does. I'm sure that there's a few who will see this video who are like, Whoa, 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 whoa. They also just kind of slip and slide through their vocabulary like that. Uh, but yeah, no, something about it just reminds me of like those... They're not plastic, but they're not glass. I don't know. I guess they probably are a certain kind of plastic, right? Those kinds of glasses... So we're making 14 smoothies in this pass. I know I've mentioned it before, but I love the sherbet background that we got going on here. Makes me want some sherbet. Yay. All right. So we got that. Oh, I didn't even look down here. Damn it. Oh, well. Blue. We got attack power up too. Attack power up to... Yeah! All right, well, we can do one of those. This one just does attack power up by two. Let's do four of those. So if I need those elsewhere, I don't want to screw myself here. Uh, and there we go. Let's do four of those. And then down to green. We don't have a lot of options for green yet. We haven't earned the ability to, you know, put it up by two, so... I guess we'll just make that one and we'll hope for the best. What did this one do? Attack up. That's fine. This is, this is okay. All right, and then we'll get started. We'll do our we'll do our, bat, we'll do our battle gym. Notice my tongue trips and stumbles on L's and R's. When I am wiped out and tired. Or when I'm wiped out and tired. All right. This smoothie is ridiculous. Correction, these smoothies are ridiculous. Alright, and then Unamas! Asparagus smoothie. Boy, that's gotta taste like death. Asparagus is fine as like a thing on the side of like doing like a steak with some asparagus on the side. It can be great, especially if you got some kind of like a like a sauce or some kind of, you know, thing going on there. Totally fine. I feel like a smoothie primarily composed of asparagus has to be mortifying to drink. Alright, Battle Gym, we'll get the lime smoothie recipe, so that's probably going to be our, our two-up thing. Also, I do love, like, key lime pies, and I love, like, a lime ricky and, like, stuff like that. I feel like a lime smoothie has to be a potent drink. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna chair pose this guy. I'm sitting here going like, yeah, I'm ready. I'm gonna do that when we start. I'm like, what the hell's wrong with me? Ah. 
Nice. Alright. What's next? Alrighty. Do some wide squats. We haven't done some wide squats in a while, have we? Sorry. <laughs> Hmm. Not sure if we'll quite be knocking these guys out in one go. Also, are two of these kennel bells and one of them is a bell dog, or do they just have variant sizes? Best five wide attack. So we got 430, 455. I think this one's 490. We are absolutely going to up the strength here. Uh, color is pretty meaningless on this one. Oh, God. I don't know if this affects ones that we already did. That was maybe a mistake. I don't know. We'll see, I guess, right? Should be obvious, right? If there's like a huge difference. <sighs> stupid, stupid, stupid. All right. There we go. We should at least. I mean, the matter rays are definitely gonna be dead. Kennelbell, I think, will be dead. Come be a little close. Come on. Yeah. All right. Number four. Interesting. All right, let's wide squat it then. Oh, we can't. Ah, okay. Well, uh, we got 560 on Pendulum Bend. So let's make that blue. Actually, if I do that, no, what I really should do is I should up the attack power. I could recharge my skill. I may as well, right? Like, I'll do that. And actually, ironically, now this makes wide squat an option again. I was going to say, I'll do that. That way the power's up. Actually, this is probably a better move then because of the Dark Hoplin and the Dark Matter Ray. Blue Dark Heart is probably going to take eh, comparable damage. I may not have needed a full move for it anyway. This also does free up those used up moves if I need them in the final round, so that's fine. I 
Did somebody die? Oh, just barely. Nice. Alright, last round. What do we got? Dark Puffer Squish. Alright. Got our attack up by two still. So let's do it the old fashioned way. I don't think this guy's going down in one turn regardless. There's a part of me that kind of hopes that in the final world they have a battle gym that's like entirely composed of like mini boss monsters. Like give me the Suffer Squish, give me the... Would it be Pit Bell? Give me all that stuff. The Stompers. Was there a Gob Hoplin mini boss? I forget. On my shirt. More. Add guard. Okay, nice. <laughs> So we're going to come out of this having taken no damage. That's awesome. Uh, now it's just... Oh, it did... My, my power did go down since you see it right nice. Just to be safe. No complaints here. Alright, All right, so Cobalt Bell Dog, Blue Dark Heart. What was in the first? So it's like, it is kind of sorting them too. So I'm just trying to see if there's any obvious, like, a difference between some of these. Bell Dog's bigger than Kennel Bell. Okay, yeah, so I think the experience applies to the entire battle, even if you do it. Oh, yeah, smoothie bonus at the top there, and it's literally 36.95, which is half of 73.90. Okay, cool. So, in a battle, if you realize, wow, I've been fighting for a long-ass time, you can still do the experience drink and have it apply, so that's good. All right, lime smoothie recipe. Cool. All right. Uh, let's take a look at that thing. Lime smoothie, attack power plus two. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, let's see, six minutes. Uh, any requests for us to do? I think we might actually just call it here and have it be a slightly lightish day. And then tomorrow, we got two levels, some gold hoplins, and then we'll probably save the the uh, the game gems for Thursday, and that'll be that plus requests probably. I'm sure there'll be requests that'll come up before then. But let's do our cooldown. I had B for that. That's weird. That it, or rather, not B, but like the down, the button that's in the downward position. They were very smart, actually. A lot of Switch games have been doing this, where uh, if they want to show you like a button for confirm, they don't say A unless you absolutely will be holding it in that position. They'll they'll have like that symbol with the rightmost button lit up. Which I think is kind of a neat. Why am I still holding this? Which I think is kind of a neat. Um, thing to do. I think it's a smart thing to do, I guess. So the camera may just die before we're done. It's not 30 minutes yet, but the battery is quite low, so if it dies unexpectedly, I apologize. So yeah, bit of a light, bit of a light um, exercise today. Uh, but we did get a battle. I was expecting the battle gym to take longer. I was kind of assuming, based on where we were before we started it, that that was going to take the rest of the episode regardless, but that's alright. Uh, 
So day day one hundred thirty two. Bring yourself back. Uh, plus the rhythm game and the warm up episode. Now has this tied as our fourth longest, the fourth most episodes on the channel. We'll be passing Pokemon Sun tomorrow. Uh, and it's very, it's, I, I actually had been meaning to look, it's really far up the list in terms of like longest for time also, because if you think about it, each of these videos is in the ballpark of half an hour long. Some shorter, some longer. Most shorter. Uh, so we're probably looking at was so 132 plus two, but uh, we're probably looking at about 60, maybe 62 hours, something like that. Maybe a little less. Might be might be more like 55, 60. I'll just say 60. I'll estimate it at 60. Why not? Um, but that's really far up there as well. Like I, if we're not there yet. We're going to be very quickly approaching the long, this being our longest non-stream series uh, in terms of time. Bring yourself back slowly. Which gets tricky, right? Because these ones, actually, not that tricky now that I think about it. I was going to say it's tricky because some series, like Battle Network and Star Force, will do half-hour episodes. But this is also a half-hour, you know, series as well. Ooh, that battery's blanking. So, all right. Fully expecting us to lose camera before we're quite done here, even though we technically have about two minutes left uh, time-wise on the recording. That's okay. Whoa, wobbly. Right. Now, it's certainly not going to be anywhere near our longest just series in general time-wise, because that one goes to Persona 3 Fess. Uh, even if we split it between the main game and the answer, the oh, there goes the camera. The added on story, uh, the main story would still have been more than a hundred hours, which we're not even going to get close to with this. Tip of the day: What are the core muscles? The muscles that support the core of your body. In this game, the core or trunk of the body refers to the torso, so the muscles in the torso are called core muscles. This is a collective term referring to a number of muscles in the chest, stomach, back, and buttocks. Strengthening your core muscles can help improve posture, which may decrease lower back and shoulder stiffness. Strengthening, the, strengthening your core muscles may also help you move your body more easily during exercise. All right, well, that is it for our cool down. That is it for our workout. That is it for today. Come on back tomorrow. We'll have day, what, 133, I think. And uh, yeah, we will hopefully clear out most of what's left between here and the boss battle, whether it's Guru Inma or uh, Green Drago. See you then. Bye.